Hey guys, I am so excited to be coming to you again to do a week two review of my ultimate reset. I just posted not too long ago my week one, took me a little bit to get it up, It'll maybe take me a day or two to get this up, but I'm really excited to report how week two went. Um, if you watched my last video, you may notice that I was ex exhausted from, you know, when your body's going through a detox phase, uh, it, it really, it, it kind of working overtime and you're drawing all these sugars and toxins out of your body and it can be quite hard. Um, I had an extremely busy week and weekend so I did introduce black coffee into it. Um, I think it's, I don't think you're supposed to, to be honest, but I really, I kind of became, I kind of came to fork in the road, either quit or make it work and I am not a quitter so I made it work and I'm really trying my hardest to stick to it but it is um, I honestly couldn't have chose a worse time to do this cleanse but I am sticking it out I want to give an honest opinion to you guys um, I have been gone every weekend I travel four days out of the week and I uh, on top of that running a few businesses um, I hate excuses however it is making it quite challenging so I'm really working hard to get it going and uh, to stick as close to possible um, so last last week I had talked about for my week one I had stuck to the uh, shopping less 100% and how hard it was it was very expensive and then I found this little gem and it is called reset in a crunch if you guys have your book it's page 111 um, I discovered this late and it completely saved me for week two um, because it really gives you this is my week two options uh, it, that are really basic. Um, you have three options for dinner, three options for lunch, and two options for breakfast. And it completely saved me. And I stuck to those and they were perfect. Um, so I, I cut my shopping bills in half of you saw my last video and it made really sh traveling a lot easier as well. Um, did have a little I did stray a little bit from the diet had I guess technically a cheat day I'm gonna call it you're not supposed to it really messes up your reset but I did uh, we did some celebrating and we did tonight as well so um, it is what it is I am forgiving myself gonna stick to my diet 100% tomorrow and finish the week strong um, overall I, I'm feeling a lot better um, I'm really learning how to get my proteins and a, a perfect round well-rounded meal uh, without eating meat or dairy which is really hard because I eat a lot of dairy I didn't eat a lot of meat but it was um, still an adjustment for me so that is something that I'm really happy about and I'm learning a lot um, sticking to the serving sizes and learning your portion control is huge that's taught me a lot and really slowing down when I eat um, you know that kind of were all light bulb moments in week two for me uh, I did my comparison my you know before week one and week two after week two pictures I'm not seeing a huge change other than some bloating um, I think it's really I'm really having a hard time not working out I'm doing some light yoga and a lot of people and a lot of my friends who are coaches also say you know that they're having a hard time uh, getting on this because they're nervous about not working out but really your body is working so hard with removing all the toxins and, and bad gut bacteria built up in your system so it's a good thing so I am getting ready for week three and I'm um, hoping some of my headaches will go away I probably it's probably because of my coffee um, I once I drink coffee it makes me feel better but I do drink it black um, week three is really uh, what they call restore. Here's my little cheat sheet. I showed you week one, week two, and now I'm into week three. And a same timeline, um, but I will have optimize and uh, instead of my detox packets, I will do revitalize. And revitalize, here it is. That's what they look like. Ah! I caught it and it helps support beneficial flora in the digestive tract. So we really cleansed it out. Now we're putting back the, uh, the healthy flora, I guess, the healthy um, stuff <laughs> in your intestines. I'm so scientific. Probiotic, proprietary probiotic and prebiotic and probiotic blend. So yeah, all the bacteria, that's the right word. Oh boy, I've had a long day. Um, yep, and I take two capsules three times a day. I have done that. I am finished up with my day one of week three. So I will, I can't wait to show you my uh, somewhat 
pictures before, after, and during pictures. I'll show you what my results are. Again, there really wasn't a big of a change, but I'm feeling really good and learning a lot. Oh, if anything else, if I even if I stray from this, I have learned so much. I will finish, I promise. I can't wait to come to you next week with a, an overall review, but I've learned a lot. So this is what my week three will look like. Here we are for week three. Um, like I said before, same timeline as before, uh, except I replaced the Revitalize, or I replaced the Detox with Revitalize here. Oops, here. Um, breakfast, that lunch, that snack, that, and then dinner. Um, it, it's been really nice. I've been able to stick to that. And my reset and a crunch like before, we are on phase two, which is restore. And my fruit in the morning, which I'm absolutely loving. I thought I'd never like fruit in the morning. Um, microgreen salad. Actually, I did this one. Uh, yeah, I did this one for lunch today. The spinach salad, which is really good. Make your own dressing with the sweet potato. Um, really awesome. And then you guys, this miso soup is my jam. I love it. Uh, with the big, with the garlic veggies are my favorite. This is probably my favorite dinner so far. Um, I'm of course only on day one of week three. Week two, this is what this looked like. I really stuck with that quinoa lentil pilaf and the baked sweet potato or hummus. Um, that was really good and a crunch and of course the garlic veggies as well. So that's what we're looking at. Here are my supplements that I'm taking. Um, optimize, I take that three times a day, soothe one time a day, um, and revitalize three times a day. So I am excited to continue and I can't wait to show you what my results look like from week one and week two and uh, be looking for my review of week three. See you